I have a Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 here. I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and videos directly from the tab to your Windows computer. Also, I'll show you how to transfer uh, photos and videos if you have an SD card in there as well. And of course, we're going to be using the uh, charging cable, okay? First thing is first, go ahead and insert your charging cable, one end to your USB port on your Windows computer or laptop. Other end, you want to go ahead and just directly pop it into your your tab here okay and then right away as soon as I do that I get this message here slow charging no problem let me just click on OK now you have to go ahead and sign in so let's go ahead and sign in here and then once I do that I should get something that pops up on my um, to allow access on my tab now nothing here pops up no problem let's go down to the file explorer down here let me go ahead and tap on that Oops. Let me tap on the File Explorer here. And then, okay. So you can see right here, it says uh, Galaxy Tab S7. Now, a lot of times what will happen is you'll get a message on your tab that says Allow Access. You just got to press OK. I'm not sure why I'd have to press OK, but it automatically shows up right here. So I see my Galaxy Tab S7. So let me go ahead and click on that. And now you can see I have two drives in here, okay? So one is my internal memory. The tablet is my internal memory. And this is my SD card. So for example, if we go to uh, my tablet here, let me double click on the tablet. And then if you go under DCIM, now this is where all your photos and videos are, okay? It's gonna be under camera. Also, I have screen recordings on here and I have screenshots. So if I go under a camera, let me double click on camera. And now you can see all of my, uh, my photos and videos from here. So from here, if I want to transfer to my Windows computer or laptop here, I can just find whatever video or, or uh, photo I want. I can drag and I can just drop it right onto my desktop. And you can see that file is right here, okay? I mean, what I typically do is just go to my desktop and I right click and I'll go down to new and I go down to folder and then I'll go ahead and name this folder. You can go ahead and rename it to whatever, but basically if you want it, everything on here, or you can choose and select. So for example, if I want all of them, I'll just highlight all of them, and then I can drag and drop this right to that new folder that I just uh, created, and go ahead and let it transfer. And now this new folder, if I double click, now all those photos and videos are actually on my Windows computer. Now, in regards to the SD card, if we just go ahead and click on the, uh, the back, the back button here I'll click on back again back again and then if you go under here where it says card is the same thing so if I double click on card which is my SD card or external storage now if I go under DCIM and then on the camera I only have a few photos and videos but same thing under my SD card as you can see here so pretty simple I transferred um, everything that's on my internal memory on my tab to my uh, my desktop right here. So pretty simple to do. Any issues, just comment below. Good luck.